Hello. Um, happy Monday. I thought it would be interesting to attempt a videotaping of my unboxing of my Hero Arts kits. kit. I really wanted to do this in front of the sliding glass door so we'd have better lighting, but I live right next to a really busy road and I have to open the sliding glass doors because they're tinted. Ergo, you would be listening to trucks drive by. So I'm doing this in my craft room, which is not the best right now. I need to get some supplemental lighting. Right now the light is from the ceiling fan, which is right above us, and then of course the camera's in the way. But I'm going to attempt this and we'll see how it goes, even though the lighting is not the best. I just tried to film opening my Alta New Watercolors and that really didn't go very well. So hopefully this will be a little bit better. I did order one of the add-on items, which is this um, bold background set. I'm gonna move the box a second, hold on. Oh, that went really well. Um, so I ordered this background die. I think it's beautiful. It's, it's a stamp. And I think it's beautiful. Um, it's gonna be a lot of fun to color. So that is an add-on item. Move this carefully back. So we have the thank you card that comes in all of the kits. And, oh, I got the catalog, the Christmas catalog, yay. Something to look at before bed tonight. Let's move this box. Sorry about that. Okay, ta-da. I don't know why I flipped that over. Hi, I'm super goofy. I hope you guys are okay with that. So here's the kit. This is the, um, the lacquer which we've had in a previous kit. And this is the puff embossing powder, which is new. And then some, um, I think this is hand dyed paper. Oh, it's really thin, tea dyed maybe, I think it is. That's really pretty. Can you see that? I hope that comes across. It is, uh, oh yeah, it's coffee, you can smell it. Um, it's really pretty though. And then, like I said, the lacquer and the uh, puff embossing powder, which I can't wait to try, mainly for Christmas, but that's a whole other story. Then we have this stamp kit. And this is a coffee and tea themed set, which is not really my thing, but I think they'll be fun to color and to do some interesting techniques with, especially with the puff embossing powder. Oh nice, we'll open this. Here are the matching um, dies. I'm really excited about this frame die. I think I've seen a lot of the designers in the in the samples watercolored this and they turned out so nice. So that's uh, something I'm going to attempt to do. We'll get the stamps out so we can have a closer look. There we go. So, some cute sentiments, espresso yourself, I like that. We're the perfect blend, but first coffee, world's best friend, love you more than coffee, a hug in a mug, here's <laughs> the cream in my coffee, java junkie, take a break, you're sweet, you're hot, thank you. I bet these are sized to fit on the cups too. These are um, extra stamp stamps, so you can, stamp the mugs and then fit these sentiments in there. I'm sure that's why they're that size. Get stuff done, that's cute too. Yeah, I'm kind of excited about this even though I'm not really a coffee or tea person. You could do like a hot chocolate too. Yeah, this is cute. And then we have the matching dies. So you can cut out the mugs or the uh, foam, matching foam. These are really cute. And then like I said, this frame is gonna be so much fun to color. What do you guys think about this, the new kit? I think there's still some available. And I was really surprised. I was looking on the website the other day, um, this weekend for some ideas, some card making ideas. And I saw a lot of the kits that have been released this year are still available. So I know in the past they sold out really quickly. But if there's a kit that came out in the last like six months or so that you really wanted your, to get your hands on, 
check the website. You might be surprised to see some still available. Uh, I know I was. Um, and then uh, let me know what your favorite kit is for the last year too. Um, I kind of bugs me that I signed up for the kit before or after the fairy kit and that one sold out really quickly and, and every time I see a card made with it I get really sad but I guess that's life anyway I uh, wanted to unbox this with you guys and shoot a video and um, I'm going to get some lighting soon and make more videos and hopefully the lighting will be better and I won't ramble so much just like in my blog when I'm typing I ramble out loud too. Thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate it. And thanks for taking a look at the new kit and I'll talk to you later.